So during the course of my exchange semester, I've been involved in some really great communities, one of which is Code First Girls. And basically Code First Girls is a non-for-profit social enterprise that aims to get women into coding because technology um, tends to be a quite a male-dominated sector. It aims to build skills and confidence in women. I got involved with the HTML CSS beginners coding course at Sheffield University and I really enjoyed my experience. I went into the Code First Girls course knowing absolutely nothing about um, coding and technology even though I was really interested but the great thing about Code First is that um, they teach you a lot of skills like basic skills and then give you the tools and resources to build upon that and basically I went from knowing zero code to knowing some HTML, JavaScript, um, how to collaborate with other coders on GitHub and towards publishing my very first live interactive website. Basically the Code First Girls um, course ran eight sessions across eight different weeks where they cover a different topic and by the end of it I was confident enough to go out there and build my own website and create web um, resources which was really cool and before I finish this video I just want to show you guys some snippets of my final week at the coding course where we actually presented the project that we were working on which was a website about Christmas markets in Sheffield and just in the UK in general. So today is the last session for our autumn winter, uh, for our autumn winter um, um, CFG course and I'm really excited to see everyone's projects. Like this one, see? Look at that! about what the idea of the website is and all of the slash their new website and at the moment it's just got the one for Sheffield and the idea is we've uploaded all and then put a map next to the wall and have a description so it's turning into basic information about that from all of it. Good idea. And we've got our social media button there at the bottom as well. Oh, it doesn't go anywhere because we don't really exist. <laughs> and our submit form as well. It's probably a linking issue actually. He probably mm -hmm. had a relative link or something that's not quite right when you've uploaded it. Um, and that's fine. Just got the tips and tricks section. Mm -hmm. And this is just giving like some tips and tricks about what the best way Giving some tips yeah. about that. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah. and contract money. That's like a small amount of jQuery put in. So um, if you, depending on how much of content you want to do. Uh, so, oh, just show more and show you. Yeah. So. Uh, and cool. And then at the bottom, we did try to divide into columns of Bootstrap to put the Instagram in, but I think um, it blocked some plugins, so um, I'm not sure why, but like sometimes the images show up like in the corner, and um, yeah, it just has some script. If you put that load on safe scripts there, it should yeah, probably be. Yeah, sometimes it works. Oh, woo! It looks much better, but... Yeah, good job. Yeah, yeah um, oh, I like <laughs> yeah. um, did you, is it responsive? Mm -hmm. If you've got columns in it, it should be. Yeah, it should be. Ah, yeah. oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I have another like silly question. You know that photo? Where is it? Where was it taken? <laughs> um, yeah, I like I like the look of that. <laughs> <laughs> That's. Give on a trip to that one. Yeah. Trip. No, seriously, where is that? <laughs> Berlin, ah. Uh. I don't know about this picture, but if I had to look at it and someone asked me, I'd say it was the Schlossenberg Schloss in Berlin. Ah, beautiful. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> it's beautiful, thanks. <laughs> yeah, so. Yeah, that's our website. Brilliant, thank you. So Code First Girls was a really interesting experience for me. It really opened up a lot of pathways 
um, that I could consider in the future. Like I come from a completely non-STEM related background. Um, if you're interested, I study law and finance. So um, usually you wouldn't expect um, that to involve much tech, but um, I became interested in tech once I've been hearing about applications of technology in both sectors like with fintech, um, cryptocurrencies, there's robot lawyers, online legal databases and all that and I knew I just had to learn like I've always been interested in tech in some way or other I've always wanted to learn to code so Code First Girls was a really good pathway into that um, field because um, yeah, it just equips you with all the skills and knowledge in a very um, open, supportive and empowering environment.